Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, this is Richard Reviews Children's Books. I am Richard, and today I have for you... Make Money, Have a Lemonade Stand by Bridget Heos. And this is the story of a woman who wants a, a little girl who wants a toy. Toy is kind of expensive, so in order to go and, and get the toy, she has a lemonade stand. And this is a, a slight introduction to basic math. It's a fun little story, but I do have to point out that, as with other books in this series, yes, it teaches you math, and it teaches you to work for a living, but do you want your kid, in this day and age, going out there and making lemonade, having somebody come back and saying, yeah, your lemonade made me sick, and I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to sue you now, sort of a thing. So, yeah, cautionary. I mean, you, you might want to tell your kid this is just a story. It's a fun little book. The images in this, the artwork is really great. I mean, you know, you look at that, that's bright colors, and it's big, and it's, it's entertaining. And I think children will love this from an artwork standpoint. And the mathematical portion is, again, very important. And this is, again, a very solid book, well constructed. And I like books like that. But the question remains, is this the kind of book, is this book telling an appropriate message uh, there have been multiple books in this series. One of them is to do yard work. I've already reviewed that. Another one is to wash cars. I have not yet reviewed that. And I like the message of it teaches children to uh, work hard and get their money in an appropriate and responsible way. Again, only you can tell whether you have the kind of environment that would permit these children to do this. I mean, the days of having a lemonade stand are kind of gone. If you're going to do that, you need to, to go out there and get a work permit and, and work at, at whatever it is. So that's one of those things. I think this book may be a little on the outdated side. In any case, maybe I'm being too harsh. Maybe I'm not. Why don't you tell me down in the comments below? I am Richard Leland Neal.